Hi guys, so all my clothes have finally arrived now, so I thought I'd do a quick video on what I've bought. Uh, my house is so bright, so bright, and um, I tried every like, room to film this in, but you just couldn't see me. So we're in my hall, because this is the only place I've got somewhere that I can hang the clothes up as well, so I can be holding them, and then you'll get a rough idea of actually how much stuff I actually bought. We'll go through it slowly. I'll just get my price list. So as you guys know, I have been watching what I eat since the new year and finally it's paying off. It's nearly 12 weeks now and I've been really, really struggling to keep motivated. Two things I've done. So one is I changed my diet slightly and two is I've rewarded myself. Now that's not something that I thought about doing. Some people, for every pound they lose, they save a pound and then they buy a treat or they have a takeaway or they have a treat day. I haven't done any of that. Um, so I just needed a boost to uh, keep me going and, um, you know, the motivation to keep me going. This has worked a treat. I've bought all these clothes from eBay. There is a site on Facebook or a group or a page on Facebook that's called the Great British Clothes Swap and I am part of that. It's just that for some reason now my Facebook it doesn't show me straight away when posts are being put up. I'm missing them. Um, so by the time I'm getting to them all the clothes have gone or all the ones that I'm interested in are gone. So I thought oh, I'll just have a look on eBay. And I've managed to get really lucky and I absolutely love all these clothes. So I'll show you now what I've bought. Okay, so the first thing I bought was um, this maxi dress. Now, I was thinking of summer and sitting in the garden and being too hot. And I just thought, oh, a dress would be lovely. I don't usually wear them. Um, but anyway, I was having a look for a maxi dress and I saw this one from Monsoon. It's a, a green colour and it's quite silky. But now I bought it, I realised it's more of a going out dress rather than an everyday dress. But because of lockdown, I don't care. So I'm hoping I can dress it down and dress it up. Now I didn't read the um, description properly because I didn't realise this is actually brand new with the tag on. So uh, the tag says it was £160 and whoever bought it, bought it on sale for 48 So really nice and I can wear it with the strap or without. And I paid £4.80 for this dress. £4.80. So really chuffed with that. The next thing I bought was this jacket. I just love a jacket. I think you can wear it whenever and with whatever. Anyway, yeah, so I bought this jacket. This is Frank Walder. Don't know who he is and it was six pounds so slightly more expensive but it's a fitted jacket and it's really good and i absolutely love it okay i'm going to speed it up a bit because otherwise this video is going to take ages so i bought three pairs of jeans and um, these are white stuff and they're three quarter length these were three pound twenty so love them i bought some jasper Conran jeans, just become, and I love the colour of these, absolutely love. And these were three pounds. And finally, um, another pair of jeans, and uh, these are full length jeans, and these were three pound ninety three. Yes. Yeah, so I also bought this like pinky glittery jumper, really thin, open shoulder, and I just thought, oh, that's. That's perfect for summer and this is from uh, Next and it was $1.99. I bought this jacket, another jacket, this is a linen one, again screams out summer for me and I can dress it down or uh, and this is 
Hennes. Again, don't know where that's from. And it's a linen jacket. This was £1.50. Absolute bargain. Now then, once I got this dress, this maxi dress, and realised it was a bit of an evening gown, I went back to have a look for a maxi dress that was every day. And in the end, I found this one. And this is a Jasper Conrad dress. This was £3. Now they're all my single items I bought and I also bid on two bundles for some tops. So the first bundle I won was this one. So three tops. This is like a short sleeve knitted top and that's from Sainsbury's. I'm after a white shirt and I saw this in the bundle and I thought great but it's coming. It's actually like a mint green, a really really light green but it's really nice. And this is from uh, Fat Face Fitted and then I also got in the same bundle. This one from M and Co. Right, so that bundle was £5.99 for those three tops. Now my last bundle had five items on it and they kind of um, went for like a brownie colour. Seemed to be having a bit of an animal theme going on. I'll need to wear a vest or something underneath these because they're quite see-through. So uh, per una is that m and I'm not sure. Then another uh, see-through one, this is more like a, a snake print. This one, absolutely love. This one's a bit thick and a bit heavier, but it looks like it's two tops in one. Um, but it's not, it's just sewn in. And this is from River Island. Again, bit of a animal theme going on. Then this one has got beads all the way around the top. See them? Makes it quite heavy. And this is from Debenhams. So I just thought, oh, that would be really nice with my pair of jeans. Any one of them. Maybe a jacket. And then also in this bundle was a cardigan. Now, I love a cardigan. And they go with everything. Um, the only thing it hasn't got is a button on it. But it wouldn't take me two seconds if I wanted to put a button on there. So I got five items with that one. And that was £4.98. So under a five, it's a pound a top. I don't know if you guys can actually see how many clothes I really did get. So I got two jackets, two pairs of long jeans, and one pair of three quarter jeans. I got my lovely little jumper cardigan, my two beautiful maxi dresses, my shirt, Thick woolly top. I got my lovely little summer top. Then I got my one, two, three, and four. So I've got 16 items of clothes for the grand total of £35.39p. Now then, the only expensive thing was the postage and packaging because I paid almost the same for postage and packaging as I did for the clothes. The, the postage and packaging came to £34.10p. My total was £69.49p. So I've paid under £70 for 16 items of clothing. Hi guys, so all the clothes now, uh, they've gone in the wash basket and I'll sort them later. So I've had a quick look now at stuff because I'm not I'm not very good with brands of some stuff. I know Next, Marks and Spencers, TU Clothing, I only know that from Sainsbury's because I buy my son's um, school clothes there, you know, like his shorts and trousers because I think they're really reasonable and they last really well. So I just thought, yeah, I've gone online and had a look now. So Jasper Conran, I think they were in Debenhams, but that maxi dress, the navy zigzag one with the green stripes going down it, that's £69 brand new. They're selling for like £40 on eBay. I feel really guilty now because I only paid that woman £3. And I know I know it's been worn, but it looks like new. Then I had a look at it. It is the White Stuff, not the White Company. The shop's called the White Stuff. Now, the cheapest pair of jeans I can find there was £40. 
and the jeans that I've bought are like new again so that's a massive saving the Henny's light beige linen jacket that uh, H&M that jacket it was still on their website and I paid £1.50 for it and they're selling for £24.99 the Jasper Conran jeans the cheapest ones I could find again were £40 the next jumper I couldn't find but there was one very similar to it for £14.99 now then this has really surprised me so I knew that white and blue pinstripe jacket that I bought when you buy like or you get expensive clothes you can just tell you can tell when you try them on you can tell just by the look at them the fit uh, the cut of the fabric you know the quality of the fabric so I knew it was a really good jacket this design is called Frank Wilder w-a-l-d-e-r I didn't realize how expensive the clothes were so the cheapest jacket I could find obviously they don't do that one anymore but the cheapest one I could find was £130 so I don't mind paying six quid now that was the most expensive item I bought the monsoon dress we already know that was £48 reduced from 160 and all the individual tops i didn't price them up i didn't go and have a look yeah they're from marks and spencers river island but even say five pound a top you know i still got an absolute bargain so saying those um one bundle would have been 25 quid because i got five items in it the other bundle would have been 15 because i got three items in it so the grand total was 447 pounds i would have paid if I bought all those clothes brand new and check how much money I've actually saved my tip get onto eBay and have a look even if you aren't comfortable wearing like secondhand clothes or clothes in used condition then there are loads of clothes on there still with the label on so that's the end of this video now because i feel like i always waffle on far too much thanks for watching if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more great videos like this and i'll see you soon bye